Howdy gang, FLX Beer Reviews, back again with another episode of As The Beer Swirls. My name is Dan. My name is Mike. Dan, what are we drinking? Uh, Mike, we have yet another treat out of Chicago, Illinois, Ooh. in the form of Hot Butcher for the World. And this is their aforementioned, not aforementioned, I don't know what no, I said. We didn't that. even say it yet. Yeah, that's weird. Lord Galactoctopus. Not really. Oh. This is the Chicago Fest. Oh, okay. Uh, this, so this is a Hollertow Middle Fruit Hop Oktoberfest <sighs> Stell Lager coming at 5.5 ABV. Can we just appreciate the <sighs> can art for a moment? We've got the Chicago, aka CM Punk flag, uh, the pretzel I mean, with the beer. Jets have freaking just, knocked it out of the park again. Of course, of course he did. <sighs> Why uh, do we have pretzels with mustard? Well, this right is like now? the finest piece. Of lock coating I've ever seen in my life. Oh. Like, it is so crisp and clean. Oh, my. It says PKG package, uh -huh. a 9 9 2024. So we're less than a month old. We're about three weeks out. And it says Squirrel Fest. Let me show <laughs> you. <laughs> Where's Tanner? Look at that, bro. Look at that. I'm the only one. Whoa. Isn't that so crisp? Have you ever seen like a lock coat that crisp in quite a long time? No, I have not. It's like they had a little Jetsa back there lock coating each. Can. Hey, you're not doing just the labels now. You're going to draw the lot codes on. Um, if we hadn't mentioned, this beer comes courtesy of Hot Butcher for the world. Indeed. Thank you guys oh and gosh. gals uh, over at Hot Butcher for sending off a beautiful, wonderful surprise package. Completely just like, I just got alert from FedEx saying, hey. And I'm like, hey, girl. <laughs> <laughs> We're so... You want something? I poured a little bit more. Again? That's weird. Uh, we are insanely thankful uh, for the, their generosity. This yeah. is great. I'm so happy we get to try these. Uh, so different kind of shaped oh. glassware, but hashtag proper glassware. You know it. Um, that looks pretty. Um, it. I'll tell you what. It looks like a lemon iced tea. It does have that nice kind of copper hue to it, with a nice little. Foamy, soap sudsy kind of heads. Oh, yeah. Swirls up, kind of sticks around, oh, kind of grabs the side of the glass. And just, there. It, is a, it is a beautiful it's a looking beverage. Beer. Like, I, I said it before, I really wish we had some pretzels and mustard to dip in yeah. front of this. I feel like it's going to beg for it. Oh, uh, yeah, we got pretzels. That got so weird so quick because I said we had pretzels. You didn't ask about pretzels. I got pretzels. I got honey wheat pretzel sticks. Want some pretzels? I, I, no, I want soft pretzels. I want oh, warm, the soft, soft yeah, pretzels. Yeah, yeah. I don't have that. Yeah. Like, I can soak it in some water for you. That's the FLX way. We're just pretzels soaked Ooh. in water. Uh, it's very malty. Like, it, it's, a, it's a really nice, bready malt. It's... It, it's very bready and it it has a really nice sweetness to it. But again, it, it, honestly, if you think about the inside of like an Auntie Anne's pretzel, that's kind of what it smells yeah. like, right? It smells very yeah. autumnal. Autumnal. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it does. It, it smells seasonable. Uh, it smells there's like pretzel there's, bread. There's like a little bit of toffee there. Like, then, a, like a light toffee. Yeah, because there is a sweetness in there, and I completely can see what you're saying. Oh, man, it smells good. Definitely has some Mars and vibes to it. Cheers. Thanks, Hot Butcher. Mm. That's good. Okay. 5.5%. Um, That's about where I want. An Oktoberfest style beer to yeah. eat. Wow, that's very impactful on the palate. Wow, like there, there's a sweet kind of uh, fruity kind of tart thing going on. Followed up with this kind of mm. allspice, not allspice, but maybe like some nutmeg with like toffee, kind of like burnt wheat bread toast. I'm glad you said on. that because one of my first thoughts was like, a light cigar char to yeah. it. Like just yeah. kind of hanging out in the background and man, it's adding a lot to it. That's fantastic. This would pair well with that pretzel. Yeah. Yeah. I wish we had yeah. Um, yeah. A real nice, like at least for me, a, a, a mixed berry. There's a little cherry note in there. 
uh, to it, oh. but those the the sweet bready multi notes, everything's there, but it's not overpowering. It's like an easily drinkable beer that's not going to destroy your palate or Cherry, overtake huh? any pretzels you may be. Cherry? Yeah. Cherry is what I said. Yeah, I can see that. Like the fruity, kind of stone fruity. You don't have to. No, I, like that fruity. Remember I said fruity. I can see that. Like um, almost like a, like a, a jam. On top of a oh. a nice soft baked pretzel, pretzel, and you dipped it in like the sweet kind of like semi like toffee kind of dip thing. There was a really nice like I just got a like a lemon zest orange, hmm. slightly candy note. It's Oktoberfest kind of. It's very spicy. Very like spice cabinet y kind of floral kind of jazz. You know? Okay. Yeah, I'm not getting a ton of spice, but there is a nice floral note in the back. Like it's it's green, uh it's almost like a lavender uh kind of thing in the back. This is Ooh. really good. Damn. All right, tasting notes. I'm sure we already got all of them. Sweet honey. I was just going to say, like, honey, those honey pretzel sticks you said. Yeah, all right. Mm. Looks like honey. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I don't know what that says. It's like nuts bread or nutty bread. Okay. Like an all grain. I can no, picture sure, like an yeah, all grain. Okay, yeah, yeah. Your, 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 your 27 grain bread. Right, 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 right. Like the oats on top mm -hmm. and stuff. Uh, floral citrus. So yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah. we both said floral citrus. So. Like, read that nutty thing. Well, what do you think? That is that nutty or nut nuts or nut and bread? Like what? It's got to. It's got to be nutty. I think it's nutty bread. But I can it does see look that. like it looks like nuts with an extra tea. Like the the all grain bread, with like the little yeah the little you know nuts and oh yeah like the the crunchies <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah uh yeah this is. This is a high bar uh, Oktoberfest. You pair this up with a nice bratwurst. Maybe from Costanza. Get, get bratwurst with like all the fixings on top. I need some Costanza meats and some soft pretzels, mustard, and like a case. Listen, of you could have had Costanza meats. <clears throat> you could have had them. Could I? Or are they frozen? You didn't tell me to take them out of the freezer. I didn't know that was part of my 49%. Uh, for those that don't know what we're referencing, search back for our Mortalis Glizzy beer review. Yeah. Uh, a good one. They did it in collaboration with Costanza Sausage. Uh, and uh, I may have acquired said sausage with all the ingredients from the beer in it. So. Yeah. Uh, keep an eye out for that. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is good stuff. Do we rate it? I don't think we do. No. What are you giving it? Four two five. Yeah, I'm right there with you. This is one of the best Oktoberfests I've had this year. Yep, this is delicious. I'm not usually a big Oktoberfest guy either. I usually only grab See, a, a couple I, from breweries I really. I'm really more of like. a fest beer guy than a Marza. Uh, yeah, I think you said that. I'll grab. I'll grab a Marza. Again, I'll grab it from just a couple breweries that I really. Did you get the Marza from for Quantum? <laughs> no, Adam said something. He's like, really? No Marza? I was like, I'll be back. <laughs> What'd you get? Just the the beer that I asked? I still have Happy Medium in there, so I grabbed some of that. Holy <laughs> shit! You didn't grab either of the release. I, gra I I grabbed uh, some Happy Medium because it was a month old. And okay. I was like, oh, it's primed. And then they they still had some of the uh, bottles of Blue Well, uh, the okay. not from Concentrate stuff. Huh. Oh, That's wild. I would have figured you would have grabbed the. Okay. I do. I know. I, I was uh, this is myself. delicious. Hot Butcher. We're sorry, we talked about multiple other yeah, breweries. Yeah, yeah. You knocked this out of the park. Yeah, right? it's knocked out now, of the park. Now, some people, I think, I'm like, it's not traditional. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. Yeah, I don't care. It's either. delicious. Go find a traditional one, then. All right, until next time. Yeah, thanks for watching. Everybody. That was weird, because you... I, I'm sorry, I encroached on your territory. You go ahead. Man of the people, you go ahead. Cheers. <laughs>